Africa is uniting to value nature so our future accounts for all life on Earth. We as Africans have come together as a group to address sustainable development. Twelve African nations have signed the GDSA. The GDSA, that's a very powerful statement coming from Africa, the people that are in the forefront of the climate change crisis. In the next 30 years, Africa's population will double in size. Depleting natural resources, food insecurity, and rising unemployment could cost the continent billions of dollars if not managed properly. So we need to solve the equation, how do I grow the economy without undermining the environment? And I think that is where GDSA is going to work. By integrating the value of nature into policy and investing in sustainable industry, we can reduce poverty and the depletion of our natural resources. We can transform the African landscape so nature, wildlife, and people can thrive. Over the last five years, the GDSA has grown from 10 to 12 countries. And this is all with the support of CI. Conservation International is working with the GDSA to help member nations achieve their commitments and build capacities through trainings, exchanges, and workshops. Having the ministers of our countries sit and have these discussions, you could see that together we would be able to make a lot of progress. It is in our enlightened interest to reach out across borders, hold each other's hand, learn from each other, and pursue a sustainable development pathway. Our goal is for every African nation to sign the Haberoni Declaration for Sustainability in Africa. It is our vision that all African states will be in the GDSA for the good of themselves and for the good of our environment. Join us in designing a sustainable pathway to progress. We can transform Africa together.